Today, I'm going to show you how to add a Google map to your WordPress website. I'm going to show you two ways. Way number one is free. It's a simple way to embed a single location, but it's not very customizable. Way number two is more customizable. You can have multiple markers and you can style it however you would like, but it's not free. So let's start with way number one. First, let's go to Google Maps. Then we'll search for our address. And then click Share. And we'll click Embed. Then copy this code. And then let's move over to WordPress. We're going to paste this code into a custom HTML block. Then if we click preview, we can see the map. Nice. So let's update the page and then let's view the page live. Awesome. There's our map. Now, what if your location isn't already in Google Maps? Well, it's actually really simple to add. I'll show you how. Find your location on Google Maps and long press on your location. Then click add your business. From there, it only takes a few minutes to add your location. So now I'm going to go over way number two. We are going to embed a map on WordPress with custom styles and multiple locations. To do this, we're going to use Atlas, a tool for creating custom maps. I'm a co-founder of Atlas along with my friend Carl. So let's begin by adding all four Pizzeria Libretto locations. Nice. Each marker can have a modal window. We can add content to these modal windows. So let's add hours of operation and telephone numbers. And let's also add a few photos. Nice. We can also customize the style. So let's click over to style and let's start with the marker. I'm going to change the color to red and I'm going to change the shape of the marker. Take the border off and I'm going to upload the Pizzeria Libretto logo as the icon for the marker. And I'll up the size a little bit. And yeah, I like that. Looks good. You can also change the map style. Cool. Looks good. And lastly, we can also customize this modo window. So I'm going to up the size of the title. So I'm going to change the color of the address to the red to match the logo. And maybe let's just up the size just a little bit. And we'll change the notes to dark black. We'll up the size. Okay. I like that. It's looking good. So to publish the map, let's click the publish tab. So to put this map in WordPress, we need to copy the embed code and then hop back over to WordPress. And once again, let's add a custom HTML block and we'll paste that embed code. If we click preview, we can see our map. Awesome. So there you have it. Like I said, Atlas is not free and there's really no way around that because Google charges us for every map load. But there's always way number one if you need something free. If you'd like to try Atlas, I've put a link to it in the video description below. Thanks for watching and good luck making your map.